the flower and the bee. Let's look at mutualism and co-evolution. We will look at how different species have co-evolved to have a mutualistic symbiotic relationship. Most flowering plants have both male and female parts. The stamen holds the pollen, that is the male part. The ovary holds the seeds, that is the female part. In order to get genetic diversity, flowering plants can cross-pollinate. I'd like to pollinate your seeds. Okay, come on over. Oh my god, I have no legs. Maybe we can ask somebody mobile to help. Meanwhile, Lee the bee is having marital problems. When we were first dating, you used to make me honey all the time. But honey, don't you but honey me. Maybe if you got off the PS4 every once in a while and got off your stinger, you could go get some pollen and make me some honey. Yes, dear. Lee the bee was married, you see, to a bee named Dee who lived in a tree. And boy was Dee mad, so Lee had to flee to find some pollen to make some honey. Hey, wait a minute, what do you know? I see some great flowers down there below. Hey, Mr. Bee, give us a hand. We have an issue you might understand. I've got an idea. Now listen to me. I can help you and you can help me. I need some pollen. Only a sip. I assure you it won't hurt a bit. I'm thinking if you wiggle around side to side and upside down, my pollen will be on your fur and you can go deliver it to her. Then we will have lots of flower babies. It's a deal. So the flower and bee made a pack. This made them both happy as a matter of fact. Hi honey, I'm home. I have a surprise for you. Dee the bee canceled the divorce lawyer. Dee and Lee renewed their vows to start over. Then came the babies. At first it was okay, there were only a few, but then came more, and Lee did not have a clue that bees can lay thousands of eggs, not just a few. I think Lee should have paid attention in biology class, don't you? Thank you for watching.